What's going on? In this video, I'm gonna give you a mini chat tutorial covering the three things that your messenger bot must have. So thing number one is you've got to have a greeting text. Thing number two is you've gotta have a main menu. And thing number three is you gotta have a welcome message. And I'm gonna show you how to set that up with your, the right settings for your Facebook fan page and everything like that. But before we jump into it, I have to tell you about our free mini chat cheat sheet. So we've created a free PDF and a video tutorial that covers the 11 crucial features that your ManyChat Messenger bot must have. If you wanna download and watch this video completely free, then go to bit.ly slash mccheatsheet. That's bit.ly slash mccheatsheet. Make sure that you're signed into Messenger because we're gonna be sending you that in a Facebook message. So now let's go ahead and jump into the video. All right guys, so we are now here inside the Facebook fan page settings. So it's really easy to get here on the back end when you're logged into your Facebook fan page, click over here in the top right settings, and then you're gonna wanna be on the messaging tab right there. Now you wanna make sure that these three little sliders are slid on. So the three things that you want are use the return key to send messages, Believe me, that's a little insider tip. Once you start messaging people, you wanna make sure that when you can hit return or enter, that it's gonna send that, cause you know, it's just a pain, it's annoying. So make sure that that is on. Prompt people to send messages. This is a super important one. So basically when people are visiting your page, um, when they're visiting, it'll just automatically shoot up a messenger window. So you wanna make sure that that is on. It will just automatically open the chat window. And if they automatically open that chat window, you wanna make sure that your greeting text is what you want it to be and telling them to click the get started button. So you wanna make sure that that is on and you need to now edit this greeting text. So again, greeting text, uh, make sure that the prompt people to send messages and the return key is on. Now we're gonna jump over to ManyChat and I'm gonna show you how to now edit this greeting text. Okay, so we're in ManyChat, we're in the settings area, general settings tab, right here is where you hit up the greeting text. So you can just click right here. I always like to have the first name tag. How you put that first name tag in there is you just click to get the cursor. You click these little parentheses symbol things right here. And then you can pull in their first name, last name, full name, whatever it is. So I like to say, hey, first name. Click get started below, you know, to get started and get these going. Because in order for them to become a subscriber on your messenger bot, they have to click that get started. That's what makes them actually engage with your bot and makes them become a subscriber. So the greeting text should always be telling them click get started. I've had so many people get confused by messaging my page when I didn't have this greeting text and they didn't know that they needed to click the little get started button at the bottom so they just bounced, they just left. So I lost them as subscribers, lost that communication. So you wanna make it very clear that they click the get started button at the bottom. So that is thing number one. Make sure that you have your greeting text on and you have, you know, based on your settings and that you have your greeting text all established well and good. All right, thing number dose that we're gonna cover is the main menu. So we are here in automation, main menu. This is my main menu right here. This is what I have set up. So I would recommend setting up something similar to this. Basically what I have is a subscribe to YouTube, need marketing services to get people into done for you services. We have two parts of our business. We have do it yourself business uh, where we sell templates, we sell information, courses, things like that for people that are wanting to do it themselves. And then we have the done for you services where people just hire us, we're an agency, and we go ahead and do the work for them. So if you are interested in having some done for you services, hit up that, uh, go to our message messenger page hit up that need marketing services, book a call with us and we will talk. If you're looking for done for you services, then we got a whole bunch of templates and things that will help you get started in building out your messenger bot. Anyway, back to the video, um, here in our main menu, and I'll show you where this main menu is here in a second, but let me just show you kind of what we've set up here. Uh, get the freebies. So we've got our different freebies, like I mentioned before, we have our many chat cheat sheet. So when they click this button right here, it's going to link them over to the actual uh, cheat sheet link and that's gonna start the message chain. We have our free Facebook ads course. 
you know, there's a lot of information that we have in this course, and then we have a free ClickFunnels account. So if you are interested in signing up for our free Facebook ads course, we also teach ClickFunnels how to write sales copy. We teach a lot of stuff in this free course that we give away, but obviously we only have so much text for the button, so we just put free Facebook ads course. If you're wanting a free ClickFunnels account, then you can jump in there and you can get a free two-week trial of a ClickFunnels account when you sign up using that special link. To edit this menu, you just click edit over here and the subscribe to YouTube, I've created a bit.ly link. You can create a special, if you're trying to do what I'm trying to do and grow a YouTube channel, then you, you get your subscribe link for your YouTube channel. If you don't know how to get a subscribe link where somebody clicks on that link and it, when they visit your page, that little subscribe button pops up, then Google that. It's very easy to, to find out how to do a, a subscribe link. We turned it into a bit.ly link so that we can actually track you know, the clicks and see where they're coming from and all that kind of stuff. So that is our subscribe link. The marketing services links over to our actual marketing sales page and our landing page and everything like that where we have all of the information about the services that we offer. So if you're interested in that, go to evolvemedia.agency. Again, evolvemedia.agency. It shows it right there if you're interested in getting some done for you services. And then the get the freebies is actually a drop down menu. So you would want to make it open a sub menu when clicked and then you have all of these options you can add in here. This one, the mini chat cheat sheet is just a bit.ly link that I told you about before. Again, you gotta go pick this up. It's 100% free and it has a ton of value in it. So many people after they get in there and they watch this video and they get the PDF, they're like, wow, you actually cover a lot of information for free. So they're super happy about it. So again, go to bit.ly, that's bit.ly slash MC cheat sheet after you're done watching this video and jump in there. And then the ClickFunnels account is the link over to ClickFunnels and giving you that free, it's a little special link that'll give you that free two week trial on ClickFunnels. So that is pretty much how you set up your main menu. Now I'm gonna show you where that main menu actually is and how people actually see this. So when people are actually viewing your Facebook fan page, looks something like this, right? You wanna make sure that this call to action button right here says send message. So when they click that, it's gonna pop open this window. Now here is that greeting text that I showed you. And you wanna make sure that it says get started. They're gonna click the get started button. That is going to then send them the welcome message, which I'm gonna show you how to set up the welcome message here in a second. But I first just wanted to show you how the main menu looks. So this little three lines right here is the main menu. So if they click on that, now it's gonna pop up that little main menu I showed you and they can click on any of these. If they click on get the freebies, it goes over to the sub menu. This looks like this on desktop, but on mobile, it actually looks a little bit better. So when you're on the mobile app, the messenger app, you can actually just swipe up and then instantly it'll show the main menu. So please believe that a lot of people will see the main menu. So you wanna make sure that you have your best call to actions, the places where you want people to go. You wanna make sure that your main menu has all those different things. Cool, so now I'm gonna show you how to set up this welcome message so that when somebody does just message your page out of the blue, you wanna make sure that your welcome message is set up the way you want it to be. Back over here in ManyChat, we're in the automation section, welcome message. And right here, we're just gonna jump in to edit this so I can show you the features. We greet them by name again, saying, hey, first name, thanks for reaching out. Click one of the buttons below to start or just send us a message with your questions. So again, we link them over to the YouTube subscribe link. Got the bit.ly link there. And you can also add in tags, like if you wanted to add a tag to somebody that clicked on your subscribe, maybe so that you can you know, segment them differently. Um, definitely I'd recommend adding a tag. You can also add them to a sequence. So if you set up a, uh, under here in automations, you got sequences, you can set up an actual multi-day message sequence. So when they click on that, you can add them to a sequence, maybe follow up with them and say, hey, we saw that you clicked on the YouTube subscribe button. Did you watch any of our videos? Do you wanna see this video? You know, and then send them another video or something like that. Uh, the want to hire us button will link over to our evolvemedia.agency website, has all of our portfolio information, goes over all the different services that we offer. So you can check that out. And then the want some freebies sends a message. When they click on it, it sends the message. And then we link them over to the three freebies that we have. So obviously you can see this welcome message is very similar to the main menu, but it is because our core call to actions that we are trying to push right now, um, 
And so that's what I'd recommend for you. So that is the welcome message, how to set it up in ManyChat. And again, you can do all your tweaking and stuff like this. Um, I think I'm going to, I'm gonna reduce the delay time down to five seconds for in between here. So it's just that easy to change up your welcome message. Hit publish. It's saving those changes. Again, last time, if you haven't got the free cheat sheet yet, now is your time to go to bit.ly slash MC cheat sheet. That's bit.ly slash MC cheat sheet. You're gonna get a PDF and you're gonna get a video tutorial explaining the 11 crucial features that your ManyChat Messenger bot must have. So go over there now. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hit the like button at the bottom of this video, subscribe to the channel, and let me know your thoughts in the comments below if you have any questions about any of this stuff. And I will see you in the next one. Peace.